On this episode of the Rewind Report, Gangnam Style breaks YouTube. Hi, I'm Michael Joseph, and welcome to the Rewind Report, the show where we take a look back at the past week's DJ and music-related news. On this episode, Ayrton Magic Ring R9, Touch Able 3, United States of Pop 2014, and Gangnam Style Breaks the YouTube Counter. First up today is a leftover from the LDI show and could possibly be the most impressive LED light I've ever seen. Ayrton Digital is known for some of the most dazzling pro-level stage lighting in the business, and the Magic Ring R9 is no exception. Its 61 multi-chip, 15-watt RGBW LED lights boasts an overall flux of 29,000 lumen, or the equivalent of over 3,200,000 candles. It also has continuous pan and tilt rotation with full range of fully dimmable macros and even a strobe effect that can flash up to 25 times per second. For more info on the Magic Ring R9, stop by the Ayrton website. Next up, if you use Ableton Live, you might want to check out Touchable 3. Major updates came to the redesigned Touchable iOS app, controlling Ableton from your iOS device better than ever with wired or Wi-Fi connection. Users can now accurately control every Ableton Live effect and instrument plugin on multiple devices hooked into one machine at the same time. Touchable 3 is currently available for $24.99 for your iPad, and for your iPhone or iPod, it is $9.99. The highly anticipated United States of Pop 2014 by DJ Earworm is here. Since 2007, DJ Earworm has taken the 25 biggest pop songs of the year and combined them into one amazing track. The 2014 version titled Do What You Want to Do combines samples from such tracks as All of Me, Happy, Turn Down For What, and Say Something, just to name a few. If you want to check out the United States of Pop 2014 by DJ Earworm, stop by his YouTube website and add another click to his almost 3 million views. And finally today, keeping on the topic of YouTube counters, Gangnam Style by Korean pop star Psy broke the YouTube counter. The YouTube view counter for Gangnam Style recently stalled at just over 2 billion views, not because people stopped watching it, but because YouTube's counter maxed out due to its 32-bit integer, meaning that it could not count to a number higher than this. They were forced to change to a 64-bit integer, or this maximum number, to accommodate the amount of views this video is still receiving. Since 2012, this song has held the world record in the Guinness Book as the most liked song of all time. And yes, at least one of those likes is from me. And that just about covers it for this edition of the Rewind Report. As always, if you have a topic or something you'd like me to take a look at, feel free to drop me a line. Until next time, this is DJ Michael Joseph saying take care and God bless. Oh, yeah.